Here we go. Greeting, challenger. I wonder where could he be? Why the heck is he up there? I'll do a backflip, mate. Yo guys, welcome back to the Hop Channel. Today we're doing some more Pokemon on Scarlet. Uh, let's get right into it. And we're getting right into a Pokemon battle. Was not expecting that. Okay, anyway, uh, let's click fight. Wait, it's ground type. What are we doing? Alright, I'm um, going to change it up. Change the Pokemon quickly. Um, okay, speed gone down. That's not going to do much anyway. So let's just drop down and go to uh, Talbot. I think I'm pronouncing that right. Uh, wait for it. Tabol, but let's go. So he's out. He's going to use Rock Tomb. But that's not going to be a problem because we're going to use a water gun now. So hopefully that'll take it out. Can we get one hit though? Can we get one hit? Oh, nearly. Okay, one more. I could just run away, but I can't be asked. Wait. Oh, critical. Water gun again. There you go. Easy little victory. They was not expecting that to even happen, not gonna lie. I was just about to set up and start recording. But, uh, yeah, anywho, welcome back to the channel, and, um, hope you're all doing well. So, like, in the last episode, pretty much, we, um, were fighting uh, a cloth, like we just were just now, but an uh, even big one, the Titan one. And, um, yeah, we, uh, defeated it. But, um, off camera, what I decided to do is do a bit of level, bit of uh, off-camera off training. So, I got all these up to level 20. Um, some of these need to evolve. Uh, I thought I'll wait to the um, when we start recording and hopefully we get it on camera. So, yeah. So now our next step is to make our way to the next town where he's got the next gym. So we are on our way there. So we're gonna quickly heal up here now and uh, we'll make our way there. So yeah. Also, what we earned as well, we got Karaidon to learn the dash. So there we go. Now we can run a lot more faster now. So that's a good thing. And um, while I was off, uh, off camera as well, I went around uh, battling some of the uh, trainers, but not all of them, but there's still a few, so we might do a few of them anyway. And um, yeah, another thing as well, obviously I caught some Pokemon as well, so we just go to our box. So yeah, so I caught some of these, by I got a Murkrow, I got a Tickerton, I got a Shinx, I got a Nibble, Nibble, I don't know, for him. But yeah, and I also like leveled up some of you. I did have a Starly as well I caught, but I evolved it to Staravia. But uh, yeah, so I might switch some of these out. But I might use Ticket Town because it's a heck of a Pokemon once it's fully evolved. So he might, uh, she might be added to the team. So let's just grab that and start making our way over to this cliff area to that um, watchtower. And um, yeah, we'll just go from there then and start making our way down to the town. Picnic area bear. So I'm going to just going to talk to this geezer. And hopefully then we've got like a bit of a spawn area then if we need to heal up it's just you then so we got some items as well for our picnic so that's going to be a lot of help when we do come to um obviously uh, doing the doing the uh, picnics so that'll be a good help there we go the team's now healed up even though i just healed up anyway but um yeah let's go battle this guy over here i don't think i've battled this person no i haven't so look at this cloth trying to come into my grill like there we go there, start a Pokemon battle. What's he gonna choose? Oh, okay then. Okay, okay, we might be alright. Bug type. So we can start using Mud Shot then. Oh, Stun Sword. Did we? Oh, sweet. Uh, what about Avoided there? Oh, what? oh, it doesn't affect. What's the type of villain at? I'm not sure, but I'll just use Slam. What type is it? I'm not sure. Go on, use slam. Another slam will do it, and then uh, we can head our way to the town then. Come on, special attack got fell. What about use another slam? Happy days. How many um, Pokemon did the trainer have? Is it just the one? Yeah, just the one by the looks. Let's go and check out this, um, obviously, this watchtower. Hopefully, we can find another um, gimme goal up there. If we do, then we'll battle it, and then it should give us extra coins. So, hopefully, in the future, we can get our own uh, our own um, golden goal, then. That's what I'm hoping for. 
I do like the what they've done with all these watchtowers. Get to see all the views and everything. So yeah, that's the town we've got to go over there. And I think that's a Team Stars base down there. The fire type. And then also you've got the, uh, another gym area down there then. Let's battle this one, bear. Obviously we earned some coins then. Alright, level 10. That's not too bad. Okay, we just use mud shot. We might be alright. Okay, one more mud shot. Take it down then. Drop the speed so... Doesn't really make a difference anyway because what way is faster. One more. Ah, oh, there we are then. Happy days. Uh -oh. Well, nothing really up here to look for other than the move we just found. Um, let's just head down, is it? Let's carry on moving through this path and get to the uh, get to the town. Uh, oh, item up here. Oh jeez. Let's go and grab this item here. We've got some portions. That's going to be very handy. Uh, there's more items down here. Okay, there's a trainer down there. Some more Pokemons. Okay, um... Alright, okay, we're just going to head over here. Okay, um, let's go over there. Let's grab this item and then we'll head down to the trainer then. Here we go. Let's battle this trainer. I just want to write a song, but it just won't come to me. I need some kind of spark. Okay, no worries, no worries. Hopefully this battle will uh, help you with your little musician sort of thing going on. Oh, okay, okay. I see what they're doing there. Ah, electric and poison. So, poison moves ain't going to do well with uh, my ground type. So, let's go for slam. Oh, sweet. We'll do it again. Attack fell. And a special attack fell as well. Alright, you slam. Easy victory. Here we go. We are on the way. We're on the way to a level and up. Don't you worry, people. We will get Whooper to evolve. Now there's a spark. There we go. Alright, it looks like we found another, ourselves another trainer. Let's battle this guy before we head to the town. Alright, let's go for it. Let's do it. Alright, what is uh is he what is he gonna send out? Oh okay, we've got ghastly, alright. Which is a uh, ghost and poison type. So these two are not gonna do very well, so but maybe poison tail. Barely any damage. Not really affected. Alright, I may have to change it up. Do we have any Pokemon with dark type moves? Oh yeah we do, okay. Come back, Whoopa. Go Crocolo. Choose you. With your Mexican hat. Ah, oh, no. Hypnosis, really? I wasn't expecting that. Okay. Can we... Do we have luck on our side? No. Alright, I'm just going to keep spamming the uh, bite, bite, bite attack. Hopefully get somewhere, because I, I am, well, I think it's still a fire type at the moment, I think until the last evolution, which it turns into a fire and ghost. Okay, not going to leave, that's no problem. Crocolo can't escape, no worries, just use bite. Nope, still sleeping. I think I have got the, um, the antidote to, um, what's it called, the, to make a man awake. Oh, never mind, he woke up anyway. So, use bite. There we go. Super effective. Easy. Oh, Mirko's coming out, so fly in. Let's switch it over to you. Come back, Crocolo. Knackley? Knackley? I can't pronounce these names, man. Because they've got such weird names. Uh, Mirko's back out. Can use rock throw. Come on, use rock throw. Use haze, so we're gonna use rock fall. A uh, rock throw, sorry. There we go. Another victory for the win. Let's go. All right, now we're gonna make it to the town, so we can start doing the gym challenge. All right, there we have made it to what's the gym? What's the place called? What was it? 
Artisone. Alright, Artisone, we are here. And uh, yeah, we're going to do the gym challenge. And hopefully we can bring home a W. And then yeah, be well happy. So I'm going to heal up quickly before we go in. I believe he's got three Pokemon, so I'm going to pick my three. So I'm going to use some of the Pokemon that is in my box. So we want to fly through this like it's nothing. So, I believe what we're going to pick for our three. Let's go to our box. Let's go for, obviously, because it's grass. So obviously we want Crocolo there as well. Put you in front. Staravia, we're going to have you. And, and... Hmm... What do I have? What do we put in there? Who do we put there? Hmm. I don't know where else to put there, man. Why not? We'll put... Nah, we're ready off flight. I like to have... No, let's chat now. No. Then three will do. At least we've got two of the Pokemon will uh, back us up easy. So we'll use them too. Then three, sorry. For our gym challenge. So let's make our way to the gym. And hopefully we can bring home a dub. So here's the gym anyway. We made it here. Let's go in there and uh, yeah, sort ourselves out. I think this might be actually the one of the easiest um, gym challenges on here because uh, there's some floors over there that you have to gather them up. I think I gather like ten or twenty. Not entirely sure. We'll find out now actually. Oh, there's Namona. Hey, uh, Hobbs. I think I'm saying that right. It's so wild that we end up randomly visiting the same gym at the same time again. What a weird coincidence. I swear, I'm not just sneaking ahead of you so I uh, I can have a lie in and wait and go. Oh wow, we might might as well battle now that you're here. No, seriously, look to to prove it, I won't even challenge you to battle this time. Much as I like to. But look at you and your Pokemon. They have definitely gotten stronger since last time. Indeed they are. They have. Add these to the mix. You'll be 100% set to go. No problem. Okay, got some for Ethers. Nice. I'll be cheering for you. I'll go, go and train like maybe 20 Pokemon or so, so while you tackle the gym. Okay, no worries. Let's go speak to this lovely woman. Working behind the desk. Welcome to the Artisone Gym. Let me register you as a challenger. Your name is Hobbs, yes? Indeed it is. Great. In order to face the gym leader, Brass, yes, you will first need to pass the gym test. Here at the Artisone Gym, the means of completing the game of Sunflora Hide and Seek. As you may know, Artisone is a city of artists. The artwork made by the people here is largely inspired by nature and the sun that natures it. Since Sunflora embodies these co concepts, we try to gather them and take good care of them. It, your job is, is to find the Sunflora locations throughout the Art Zone. Remember, these Pokemon look like sun-shaped flowers. Gather up 10 of them and bring them to the Sunflora lawn and you will pass the test. I'll register the Sunflora locations in your map app to get you started. When you leave the gym, turn right and you will see two large Sunflora statues ahead of those. When you're at the lawn entrance, the staffer there will tell you more about the gym test. Now get out there and have fun. Alright, so we got to go to the um, to the Sunflora area and um, speak to the, obviously the staff there and we can get started on this gym test. So. Happy days, let's just head straight over there. So let's uh, speak to this lovely woman there. Hi there, look after the Art Zone Gym, Gym Sunflora. Hope you're ready, Challenger. It's time for the game of Sunflora Hide and Seek. I'll go ahead and ask the Sunflora to spread themselves around town. Here we go. Sound like the Sunflores are, are ready for you. With that, the gym test now begins. Once you've found 10 sunflowers, please bring them back here to Sunflower Lawn. That's all from me. Now, good luck out there. Okay, let's go and uh, start looking for these sunflower, which is pretty basic to do. 
So let's go over. Oh, it's one right there. That was easy. One right behind me. That was a rubbish hiding spot. Didn't go. What? It's free right there? Jesus Christ. We might get this done in about less than like five minutes now. Alright, that's free. Well, what a rubbish place to you know, go hide and seek. I know this is meant to be really easy for you. And there's another one. That's four. Any more for you? Sometimes they're hiding under you. Under you. Um, none there. No worries. Here, look at the squad. All right, um, straight over here. Can I get try it? Yes, I can. All right, there's another one over there. There's, oh, three, another three. Let's grab you. Join the squad, mate. Join the Sunflower squad. And you. All right, that's six. Seven's going to be the one over here. And then we'll have to get uh, three more then. There we go. Jeez, man. This tower's probably got one of the worst lags. Look. Look at that wind turbine. Wind, windmill, sorry. Jesus Christ. Alright. Anyway. We've got three more to look for. No worries. There's head. Oh. One hiding, but. Come back. Is that mine? No. It's not mine. It was just running back and forth. Alright. Oh, no. oh, it's a wild one. Okay. We still need to go looking. Ah, oh, there's one by here. Oh, we just need one more now. And there's one over there. Oh, that was just so easy. Such an easy task. We've got to grab you. Time to head back to the sunflower lawn. And then we can claim our uh, prize to, uh, to challenge the gym leader. So we've got to do that now quickly. The squad. Easy. Easy gym test. Easy. Well done on finding all the sun floors. You passed the gym test with flying colours. Now please head back to the lobby at the zone gym to report your results. Happy days. But what I am going to do though is switch out you quickly. Because I don't really want to be using you now actually. Because I completely forgot electric isn't good against the grass. So I'm going to go with... Go on, we'll use that Tinker Tan. Why not? I haven't used Tinker Tan in battle just yet mine so... This will be interesting. But I will put King of Ten first for it. So let's just head straight to the gym and then we can start battling the gym leader then. It seems you successfully gathered 10 sunflowers and brought them over to the sunflower lawn. That means you cleared the gym test. Congratulations. You now earn the right to challenge the gym leader. Best of luck. Here we go. Time to challenge the gym leader, Brass. Yes. Let's do it. And hopefully we get it. Bring home a W. Let's do this. Here we go. Greeting challenger. I wonder where could he be? Why the heck is he up there? Can't have to do a backflip, mate. Oh, Spider-Man. Anyway. You did well to come this far. Mate, it was pretty easy. Easiest gym challenge ever. I am Brassius, the artist of specializing in grass type Pokemon. I am also a gym leader here at the Atlazone Gym. I was observing your gym test from the top of the windmill, you know. Was you? The perception you display is in finding some floor was truly... Oh, how shall I describe it? Okay. Yes, it was truly Aunt Guard. I only pray that you might demonstrate that eye of for beauty in our battle as well. Enough talk, we must begin creating our calibration uh, work of art. Do, 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 do. Let's go. I trust you that you're ready. It is time for our masterpiece to take shape. Let's do this. Here we go. Challenge, gym challenge number two. 
You are challenged by Jim, Jim Lee the Brass, yes. Alright, no worries. King of Ten, you're out. Let's do this. At this creation of the destruction and struggles that Elsa you defeat. Okay, didn't get a chance to read all that. I'm quite a slow reader. But anyway, let's go with some Metal Claw. Think that was faster. Okay, didn't do much. Okay. Okay, no worries, no worries. Okay, we've got Baby Doll Eyes. What, was, what does that do again? I forgot. Let's have a look quickly. Baby Doll Eyes. The user's. Uh, the user stays at this target with baby doll eyes, which loads the attack stats, and this moves always goes first. Okay, and what about you? The user approaches the target and then steals the target's help. Mm. No, we use rock smash. That did not do much either. Okay. By the way, what level am I? Level 14, I believe. And this is like level 15. Oh, 16. Okay, a uh, bit of a difference. Anywho, let's do baby doll eyes. Okay, attack fell. It's no problem. Because at the end of the day, uh, we still got the two other Pokemon as well, which is going to be a massive advantage. So, let's just keep using Metal Claw, and hopefully that does something. Can we do it again? Sleep Powder. No, that's not good. Uh, okay. Um... No, we'll return Tinkerton because it's probably a bad idea anyway. I'll probably have people in the comment section saying, like, what the heck am I doing? But we'll send out Staravia. We can use its wing attack then. And hopefully, it'll get it down and win it. And plus, we got the level advantage as well. That's another thing. Here we go. Own tempo. Okay. No problem. Staravia will just use wing attack. No. And I should take it out with one shot, I reckon. Alright, energy is drained. Okay, let's go with Wing Attack. There we go, one hit. I think we might use Star Raptor. Oh, Star Raptor, sorry. The Star Raven for the next one as well. Happy days. Alright, Small Liv is coming out. Uh, let's keep current Pokemon. And then I'll swap swap over with um, Crocolo as well, so he can have his bit of a shine. There we go, let's go for the Wing Attack. One hit, easy. Okay, Sudabudo's coming out. Let's switch that over to Crocolo. Because he's going to be uh, tetrasalizing. Paralyzing. Can't, you, know, you know what he does, the uh, changing type to grass. So, let's just send this boy out. This has promised me, yes, that lets us lead to the artistic... Uh, I can't read it all. Anyway, Sudabudo gets sent out. Alright, let's go with... Let's paralyze. And then we can go for Ember, and hopefully that will make a big difference here. But we'll see. Let's go. Is he going to do it? Yeah, he is. Here we go. Can't see Sudoru's eyes, man. Du -du -du. Here we go. Oh, one more hit. And he's out, mate. Here we go. Whoa -ho. Da -da 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 -da. Let's do it. Can we get it? One more. One more. We'll bring home the dub. Yes. We got another victory under our belt. And we can move on to the next uh, challenge. And uh, yeah, that will be in the next episode. So here we go. No problem, we got an easy victory with some poker dollars.
patterns of your moves, the minute detail of your Pokemon's performance, everything you did was honoured in, in perfection. Our battles was, in, in a word of art, indeed, we could not call that work of artistic than nothing and nothing else. In this world could be labelled as such. If I were to judge your work, I would say it passes. My inspections, yes, it passed with it without expectations. Expo as proof of your artistic powers, you may have my gym badge. Shall we take a photo as well? That'll do. Let's go. Another dub. Can't fault there. If you pose it with two gym badges, it will be easier to catch Pokemon up to level 30. And those Pokemon should follow your commands as well. To a fantastic trainer such as yourself, I would also like to offer this a uh, favourite of mine. Alright, happy days, we've got a new move. Sweet. Ah, my inspiration is overflowing as if it's drawn from the bottomless well. I will begin on a new piece at once. You must excuse me. Farewell. Alright then, happy days. So that's that then, guys. Um, uh, yeah, don't know what else to say until the next episode. And, um, yeah, if you guys like what you see, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Make sure you hit that like button. And, uh, oh, wait, hold on. Pardon me, would you be Hobbs? I've been uh, hearing so much about. Namona had mentioned there was a promising new face in the academy. Yes, indeed. Oh, but I do apologize. I didn't mean to startle you by addressing you so suddenly. My name is Hassel. I'm one of the elite four of the Pokemon League. I also teach arts classes at the academy. So, do tell me, young Hobbs, what compels you to collect all these gym badges and, and strive to be champion? I want to get stronger. My friend asked me to. I want to, well, I want to find my treasure. Asked and answered. Thank you. Naturally, there's no single correct answer. All paths lead to the great creator of Paldea, as they say. You know your friend Nomona is the youngest to achieve the champion rank in, pa in the whole, all of Paldean history. It is entirely possible that such great potential lies within you as well. Okay, that was random, but okay. Should you, should you continue striving to reach champion rank, you will one day have to battle me. You will be wise to train hard starting now. It will save you from expectations, the bitter, the regret of defeat. Do come along to my art class some day, sometimes. It would be thrilled to have you attend. To attend? Okay. We're not going to class, but screw that. But anyway. Well, anyway, guys. After that, I thought I was going to end it, but he randomly just turned up. All I'm going to say is, make sure you stay along to the next video coming soon. And uh, if you like what you see, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Make sure you hit that like button. And I'll see you guys in the next episode.